Hey beauties, it's Kelly Kimmy Star, and I'm here today to talk about my favorite new hair comb. My new favorite hair combs. Oh my God, I, I can't wait to share this with you. So if you wanna see what it is, definitely stay tuned. <laughs> Dun, da, da, da. This is my new hair accessory and it's my new favorite comb and it's called a magic star and I cannot remember the name of the company now. Hercules Sageman is what it says and there's a number on here 5660. I'll leave all the information below about where you can get it and how much it costs. I don't remember. I, I want to say it was like $10 or $12 or something. Um, but this is my new favorite comb. My new old favorite comb or my new, well, my, my old favorite comb used to be the Wee Dad Double Detanger. I used to love this comb so much. I, it used to be my favorite and I hate that it's not anymore. And let me tell you why. I feel like so incredibly silly. The reason why this is not my favorite comb anymore is because it has seams. I did a video on my favorite hair tools that I think every natural should have or curly girl should have. And I'm gonna put this here so you can click on it and see. And in that video, I talked about my favorite comb and how it's important to have a comb without seams. Well. Somehow in using this comb for, I don't know how many years, three years, four years now, I miss that there are seams in this comb and they're not right in here, which is where I showed you in the video. They're in here, in here, in between each teeth of the comb, in between all these teeth, there seams. And I don't know how I miss it. I feel like such a dum dum for missing it, but I did. And it was my girl L for Quest for the Perfect Curl. Either she posted about it on her Facebook page, something about seams. And I was like, seams? There are no seams in this comb. What are you talking about? And she's like, yes, there are. So I went back and looked and I was like, oh my God, these have seams. I was like, what in the world? I was like blown away because this comb is amazing. If you don't care about seams, this is a really, really good comb. It is amazing. Makes a tangling a breeze. So I was like, now I gotta find a comb that will work for me. I have horrible split ends. And one of the things they say they could be is from manipulation. And if you have a comb that has seams, it could be stripping your hair and like creating split ends. Cause I've done everything else. I take really good care of my hair cause I never could figure out what it was. Um, and I even thought it might be the comb, but I was like, no, it can't be. This comb has no seams. So when I thought it had seams, I was like, oh my God, maybe that's my split end problem. I don't know. I haven't gotten my hair cut yet. I'm getting my hair cut <laughs> in a couple weeks. So we'll see over time if that was it. But, um, so I can't, I haven't started from like cut my hair, using this comb, no split ends, then we'd know for sure, but I'm not at that point yet. But here is this comb. This comb is a great substitute for the double detangler, but it has a nice size teeth, nicely spaced, because I tried a couple combs, some that were like too close together for me that were just not good, but this is a perfect spacing. And this has no seams anywhere, not in here, not on the side, nowhere. And it even says in the description, no seams. So this comb has been great. I love it. If you're somebody who does not want seams, I think nobody should have seams just to make sure that your hair is not getting stripped, not stripped, is not getting um, damaged from manipulating it with the seams or creating um, friction in your hair. I think no one should have seams. And I hate that this double detangler does. I'm like, that's expensive comb. Why in the world does it have seams? Like, come on, make a new mold, get together. Um, but this one does not. So if you're looking for a good substitute, I highly recommend this comb. It's amazing. In fact, I need to buy another one so that I have a backup. Um, it's perfect. It's not, it doesn't like, you know, like bend easily. I mean, with all this thick, thick hair for me, it doesn't do any of that. This is a great comb. So I highly recommend you check it out. It's not too expensive. It's great. No seams. It's great for your hair. So this is my new find. I feel like such a silly person for not realizing that one had seems but whatever everybody nobody's perfect everybody makes mistakes so i definitely highly suggest you check out this magic star comb and i will leave details in where you can purchase below so if you've used this comb let me know your experience with it and i'm hoping that you're loving it as much as i do i imagine that you do because it's just fabulous um let me know and let me know if you would had any issues with the double detangler if you have split ends or not i would love to know that leave that below because i have them and i'm thinking maybe that's what it's been from all these years i've been using it for almost four years i mean really Anyway, so that's it. I will look forward to your comments and touching base with you and chatting with you in the comment section. But other than that, I will catch you guys on the next video. Bye. I can't read the ingredients because this is the one thing I don't dig about. Her line, man, these labels are a mess and it gets stuff everywhere in the shower. So I don't like that. So I'm gonna leave the ingredients below, but they are natural ingredients. And um, so the ingredients are good. It's not really an issue, but I will leave that below.